All right, Christmas trees are lining Gaffney City Hall today to make you aware of upstate charities and nonprofits. It's part of the 11th annual Festival of Trees, and Christine Scarpelli, she's live there in Gaffney with more. Hey, Christine. Oh, no. <laughs> Hey guys, good morning. Sorry about that. We have two very special guests here. Actually, plenty more than just two. We are talking about the Festival of Trees happening right now in Gaffney. This is a time where you can come to City Hall in Gaffney. Now make sure to check out the Christmas trees. That's the best part. But voting for your favorite allows money to go to the nonprofits that have decorated these trees. Not just decorated them. I mean, really, they're showing off their nonprofit. It's a great way to get the word out about what they do, spread awareness, and also have a blast. This morning we're talking to Denise. We're starting off with Denise <laughs> with Crossroads, Greyhound Crossroads. This is such a neat organization. And these two uh, rehabbed Greyhounds? Yep, they're retired racers. This is Emo. She'll be seven on Saturday. Hi, Ashton is two and a half. He just retired six weeks ago. Greyhound Crossroads has an exciting thing going on this year. We, um, we're celebrating 20 years. Wow, so congratulations. <laughs> thank you. So for 20 years we have been adopting retired racers into loving homes. Um, we bring as many up from the track as we have foster homes for. Okay. Um, we do about 200 adoptions a year throughout the whole entire upstate Georgia. And check out this tree, Denise. This is a great tree, <laughs> very well decorated. I'm going to head over to Kava now with Judy and Noah. So glad to have you guys here. Again, this is part of it. So many trees to come look at, but yours extremely creative, just like those that participate in Kava. Tell us about it. Um, Kava, first of all, represents Cherokee Alliance of Visual Artists. And our main goal is to teach, create, and display art in Cherokee County and the surrounding areas. And this is our tree's an example of our creative side. I'll say, you two being teachers as well, former middle school teachers, unbelievable. So many things handmade on this Christmas tree as well. And Noah, this is pretty impressive. Did you do any of this? I helped with that. <laughs> I just wanted to thank WSPA and the city of Gaffney uh, for this opportunity to promote the 501c3s. And getintogaffney.com is a great place to learn about everything we're doing here in Gaffney. Wonderful. These guys also want you to join, to participate. Yes. Come right here to Gaffney. Kava, we've also featured them on Hometown Spotlight, guys. They were a blast. What do you think? How neat are these trees? They are gorgeous. And I'm trying to think if I can. If once we put our tree up, if we'll come anywhere if close. It'll look that good? I don't know. I don't know. Yes. Pressure on yeah. us now. We will not top this tree. Nah, mm -hmm. you're probably right. Thank Sorry. you, Christine.